All right, it's day three here, or day four. Day four. First things first, Take look at those minute. mountains, unreal. And even over this way, it looks amazing as well. But we are going up here. This is, there's a bunch of different names for it. Some people have called it Bob's Peak. Some people have called it Mount Queenstown or the Queenstown Hill. We've also heard it's called the Ben Lamont Trail. We've also heard it's called the Tiki Trail. So there's four different names for this thing, but we're gonna climb it today. So we have about an hour and a half and you can keep going to the Ben Lomond Trail if you want to. We won't have enough time because we're driving to Monaco. Exactly, so we're gonna take you guys with us. Okay, so we've just discovered a zip trek or zip line type situation here, but it's all closed off so we can't go on it. We're going up this way by this big rock. So we just came up to this beautiful view. I don't know if you can see it at all. Uh, I think it's the remarkable. It just looks incredible across the lake. Zoom in and see if you can see it any better. That's much better. There you go. And the water is just such a nice clear blue today. Pretty amazing. Yeah, we're having fun so far. We're we've not only, even, we're hardly. Yeah, we barely, like we've gone one kilometer up so far. So Alright, so Sirachi Kins and I have just made it to kind of a flat, a little plateau area. I think we're merging with the we're merging with the mountain biking trails now. Yeah. It's been good so far. It's been good. We're pretty hot, but we're making it. I bet we're probably about halfway now. Okay. We've gone about 2.13 kilometers, it says on my watch. So, so probably, probably a bit more than maybe. A bit yeah. more. The watch has been known to lie. The ears are a bit nippy, but yeah. all good. All good in the hood. We rocking on. Searching for All right, so we made it to the top. We're just chilling here. We're watching the luge. People are going down in these little carts, whipping by, and this is our view. Pretty unreal. There's the Gandhi over there. Pretty magnificent day, man. Pretty cool. We're debating whether we want to do the gondola. Should we luge down? Oh yeah, the luge. Sorry. I don't wow, think it goes, goes all the way down. No, I think it just goes down to there. Oh. It's a pretty cool spot. First, burritos. Burritos. Okay guys, I don't know if you can see, Simon's just gone to the washroom, but there's people like, we can't, I can't remember what it's called, paragliding, hang gliding, something like that, that down there. And this would be your view. So, pretty amazing. We're gonna have burritos now, and we'll see you on the flip. All right, we're just leaving. Sarah's singing a little song she made up. It's pretty fun. But uh, yeah, beautiful view behind us. The luge below us. We've decided not to do the luge or paragliding today, but we want to do paragliding at some point. Yes, definitely never going to do the luge. <laughs> no, unless luge. you find out it's It looks fun, but like, unless not. it's five bucks, I don't really want to do it. No. Probably like more like 65 bucks. Yeah. Yeah. But we're going to do a little bit of hiking and then head, and we're going to start road tripping. Road tripping. I can't remember the rest of that song, but it's a good one. Dan and, what is it, Dan and Shay? Oh, Road sure. Trippin'? It's yeah, it's a great song. Anyways, we're going this way. This is the Ben Laman Trail, which is, looks like a construction site right now, but normally it's like a six hour hike. Seven to eight. Oh, really? Yeah. But anyways, we're gonna oh, hike wow. a little bit of it. Really and then just see. We have found an amazing lookout. We're like five minutes up. Yeah. And this is so peaceful and tucked away. It's so this gorgeous. Is where we have had our lunch. It's actually warm up here too. The sun is so bright. But we found some snow on the ground. <laughs> snow on the floor and views in the air. It's gorgeous up here. So the gold miners, I guess, initially 
carve this trail. That's why there's all these. Dug by shovel. Yeah, that's why there's these little guys wow. here. The gore juicy. Yeah. Probably enough for two. Often you've had it rough But you also had your cough fill up And we both know Every time you come around Every time you return You see it in your tired eyes This is so cool. Howdy, howdy. All right, so we just finished our hike. We just got down to the bottom of Bob's Peak. How would you rate that? Um, I would say it's fairly easy. Yeah, I would too. I would rate it as like, I mean, okay, I found it tiring to go up. It's pretty steep, but it's not, it's well maintained. Yeah. You don't need hiking shoes. Uh, I would say you'd want grippy shoes. It was like pretty wet-ish like when we you went definitely up. Definitely don't. No, you could do it in running yeah. shoes, but it was like slick enough that I would want some sort of grip, especially the way down. It's pretty steep, but yeah. Gorgeous views at the top. Amazing and views. Going up higher than the main lookout, it's way more peaceful. Yeah. And way less people. Yeah. So when you get to the main lookout where the gondola takes you. You can go up a bit higher towards Ben Lomond, which is the rest of the trail. That's like a five hour trail. And it's so worth doing. We went up to where the paragliders jump off. Yes. Them. And there is a bunch of paragliders up there getting ready. We watched two of them take off. It's pretty amazing. So worth it. So quiet and peaceful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But yeah. So no real hiking gear needed. I would say it's family friendly. 100%. Yeah. Yeah. It definitely easier. Comparing it to Mount Tauhara, which we did in uh, Topa. Easier. Definitely easier doing this one. More well maintained. Yeah, trail's way wider. And I think the views were better. Oh yeah, views way were better. better. Yeah, yeah it's so nice. Views are five out of five. You can't beat that. Yeah. Anyways, that's all for now. We're gonna the trip it to. to yeah, so we'll see you there. All right, we're just heading out of Queenstown, trying to give you a little peek of all the mountains, but we've got the cars in the way and the trees. So I'm not sure how well you can appreciate the view, but Queenstown has been a blast. Our hostel was, oh here we go, our hostel was uh, less than impressive on some friends. We can talk about that a bit later, give a review, um, but we did have a great time otherwise. And now we're on route to Monica, so we'll see you there. Yeah. Yeah. We just came to the top of this amazing lookout point. So there's the Remarkables over there. And here we are. Pretty It is chilly up here, but it's cool. driving so we can't drink. If we were staying, that'd be a good apres ski.
Mm-hmm. Anyways, let's hit the general store. Here's the view. Simon, I'll show you. Yeah, you can see actually up there is where we skied the last two days. You can see the ski hill from here. I don't know if you can see any of the lifts or anything, but it's way up there. Mm-hmm.